Welcome back to my YouTube channel and it is your girl D-I-N-K-Y Dinky the Dinkinator, the mover, the shaker, the vibe creator, terminator, master of distraction and yes I know that you are going through a lot right now, you have plans into things but they are not going the way you want them to go simply because there is that negativity playing in the back of your head telling you that you're not going to make it. Let me tell you my brother and my sister you are definitely going to make it for the fact that you are worried about achieving something you are already in the right path so the power of manifestation works in so many ways of various ways that relies on you you got the ball so how you gonna throw it and how you're gonna bounce it is absolutely up to you so i want to tell you about the power of manifestation especially when you are aiming on getting something whether it's a job whether it's a gig whether it's something that you really desire and it's something that is in your dream chart i want you to know that if you manifest it you are going to achieve it so when you manifest something it's you actually living into that thing even though you haven't received it it's you believing fully with your heart that it is yours you speak it to reality and you speak it to 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 a sense that you are already there you already got it like for example i would like to be live in a big house like in a mansion and that is what that is the only thing that i think of that is the only ultimate thing that i think of and that is why i'm putting away some money saving 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 so that i will purchase my dream home knowing that that will happen relies on you as i mentioned before because you have to set your goals before you start manifesting something you actually have to have a dream chart and people don't take dream chart very seriously because they assume that when you make such things it's like you're still in primary school you have to have a chart you have to cut down paste all these things and then you put them maybe on your wall it's literally like a vision board so that vision board will be a constant reminder every time when you wake up that this is what i'm supposed to work upon so that i will achieve it so that you will tick it and move to the next one and people don't think that thing works but it works another thing is to also develop yourself personally meaning that if each and every time when you do something and the results are not up to your expectations what you need to do is you need to develop yourself by reading books watching youtube channels that will guide you on whatever niche or whatever goal that you want to achieve read a lot of books and articles so that you will know where you went wrong and then you correct yourself another thing is to also take criticism that is coming to people in a positive way it's a correction just like in school when you got your test back and you didn't pass up to a hundred percent your teacher will give you all the corrections so that next time you will practice and practice and practice until you come to perfection but also they said one speaker once said that practice doesn't make perfect all right it 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 it, it literally gives you a skill and also it allows you to know better but that doesn't mean you're going to be perfect at what you do it's the same as people that struggle to speak english i i normally suggest that you speak english no matter how broken it is because it's not your language yet it is a communicating language that we all use internationally so break it don't fake it be what you are and the minute people are correcting you don't take it badly take that word so that you know that next time in a specific sentence i'm going to use that specific word and i'm going to speak it correctly so personal development is very important you have to have audios where you re listen to while you're cooking doing your thing somebody is saying all the positive things in the back of your mind in the back of your head and also stand in front of a mirror consistently and i affirm yourself because self affirmation is the best thing that could ever happen to yourself instead of waiting for people to affirm you or people to compliment you you have to do it by yourself so every morning when you wake up and while well, you're brushing your teeth because we all know that the, the the basins where you brush your teeth there's usually a mirror that's where you start to tell yourself that i'm gonna have a the great day i'm gonna have the best day i'm gonna achieve a certain whatever goal that you have already like set up and lined up for yourself and i'm the best i am beautiful I 
am unique and I'm special. If you keep on doing this every day, nothing will break you, no matter how many times people try, because you know that people are very toxic and people do not want to see other people succeed. No matter how many times people will say congratulations, there is that 40% of that of people who are just saying congratulations simply because they are sheep factors, they are following all the other people that are saying congratulations, but it's not like they are really congratulating you. They are actually asking themselves like why you why were you chosen to 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 have this specific life why were you chosen to have this specific job why why were you the one that was hired when maybe uh, for example I have the same qualification but it looks like you are succeeding and I'm not and also guys please forgive me it's raining and there is a thunderstorm but it is what it is we have to do what we have to do and now because like I've been going about doing all these videos about the auditions listen yeah listen when you go there rock the boat rock the boat like nobody's business rock it like there will never be any other opportunity that comes there you know in a sense of learn other people's culture when you get there do not despise the food that is eaten always try even if you don't like it give it a nice feedback because you remember that there's going to be so many uh, tribes that are going to be part of this so you need to make sure that you align yourself uh, correctly with everybody and you blend in nicely and by blending in nicely it means that you are going to go there and you are going to respect other people's religions and beliefs as much as uh, politics and religions are not allowed to be discussed in the show because they create so much drama because what I believe in is something that you don't believe in just make sure that when you do your thing you don't do it in a sense that it's gonna make another person feel some type of way or you might even get disqualified this is what I would like to tell you and also while you are going through the process for you to actually get this opportunity you might also be disqualified even through the process so respect the producers respect the makeup artists respect the cameraman respect each and every member of the crew and show them that even when you are inside you are going to give them content for days and also even when you come outside that opportunity that you were granted to be part of the show is something that you're going to utilize so that you will succeed respect even though you find that one of the members in the production team is rude just show them that you are coming from a very very well men at home where you have home training and you do not disrespect people regardless of whatever that they said it's going to be very hard you are going to find moody people you are going to find people that doesn't have patience but they chose to do a specific job sometimes you're also not gonna find a, a photographer that 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 has passion in that sense they just doing this because it's a job and then when you're taking photos simply because maybe you are you don't like taking photos they're not gonna lead you through the way and your profile might not also be nice so go there knowing that all these things are things that you are going to meet and and you are going to let them slide it is like a, a time period that makes you learn to live within your soul and your emotions and do not take out your emotions and your feelings out of anybody and regardless of what they did i repeat do not allow anybody to get into your head living this thing and manifesting it is the only way that's going to get you into the house no matter how good your video was but if you don't speak it to reality and there's a doubt at the back of your head chances are you might not even make it believe it speak it and always imagine yourself already right now that you are already there deprive yourself from certain things that you know deeply inside that when you get there you're not gonna have access to don't watch too much of TV right now so that you will also be able to know that when you are there there is no TV there is no newspaper you don't have access to your cell phone so you are shut out and you are in this world by your not by yourself uh, to to be exact but you are surrounded with these housemates and sometimes things happen in the house House that leads you to want to take out that anger something that I couldn't control myself and if I was there longer I, I, I think that maybe if, if, if I didn't physically fight with somebody I was literally gonna get disqualified for maybe not completing a task 
or not doing what was supposed to be done and remember that you don't know what time it is right there you are going to be so disorientated your life will never be the same again you might sleep at 4 a.m thinking that it's 12 a.m and then when the alarm hits off you cannot even wake up because you barely slept you only slept for like um a few hours and you have to do exactly what big brother advises you to do if you need to go to to the arena and have to go and gym do that like do not check your friend that thinks that they they are controlling this house and they are saving us content just because they are stubborn coconut head and they think that they have arrived they made it in life simply because maybe they lasted for specific weeks not knowing what the team behind the scenes are actually discussing about this person that person might be disqualified and you simply think that this person is cool because they do whatever they want and they're getting away with it you might also get yourself disqualified for certain things that doesn't matter so be excited it's like a holiday it's like you shutting away from the world that is toxic you are not watching any cnn sabc one news where there are new diseases that are advertised or or, or maybe um we are informed that there's something new that is coming some you know how the world is like when every time when you go on social media all that you see is like rest in peace rest in peace and all those things like they drain us as the youth because if you see another fellow youth member passing away or dying rather it it makes you wonder as to like when is your time really gonna come when young people are dying this much so browsing through the internet on a daily basis can also impact you in a negative way can also impact you in a positive way because it is what you choose on your phone that will um that will tell you the person that you want to be that is why when you when you go on on youtube or tiktok or wherever whatever that you always search is the content that you're gonna be recommended for you to watch so make sure that everything that you are checking right now is things that will develop you and make you that cool person and i'm not necessarily saying that you need to be fake i'm not saying that you need to act like another person or be a person that you are not but respect goes a long way and have fun but if if you are a fun bubbly outspoken person do not change that but what i want to channel down is respect yourself and respect the next person and don't go there fighting for food guys like yo please don't fight for food do not give us an impression that back at home uh, like you guys were super hungry and you didn't um, afford certain things that you're gonna find in the house because sometimes we found ourselves in the situation where we don't have specific things and we see them for the first time at normal act cool act like you know them or even if you don't know them but just don't overdo and overuse and be in conflicts that has to do with food like we've been embarrassed so many times with people having arguments of food like and then in the next two minutes like bona carbon dioxide but then when up when I over the so literally uh, do not involve yourself in anything that has to do with food as many as you are in the house and as much as there is food there don't go like us who just went there you are eating papaya the next thing you don't finish the papaya you're going for the pay the next thing you're not thinking for the next person who doesn't eat, eat the papaya you could have reserved that pay for the person that doesn't eat papaya but no because like it's big brother's house big brother's rules big brother's food nobody's gonna tell you otherwise you're gonna do what you're gonna do and don't be a bully and being a bully is in a sense of you you know when you are in school there's this person that wants to have everything or they want people to to eat specific things when they want to no matter if you are chosen to be the head of house it doesn't afford it, it doesn't it doesn't say that you have to take certain things hide them and tell people that they're gonna be eaten on friday who are you whom are you like for the for the why for the who for the what whom are you i told you guys that i'm gonna be making videos for this time period and i'm gonna be also making videos uh with regards to the show because like um it, it will be the first show that really makes sense to me and it's something that is very new and fresh so i'll be reviewing some certain things and i'll be like giving also some like um like maybe uh, how can i put it 
I will be reviewing videos, I'll be reacting to videos and for those that are not able to watch, I'll be giving them a glimpse of what happens on a specific day. It will be like a daily thing. So that is why I'm currently doing this right now so that you can get yourself used to the fact that I'm all about Big Brother Titans and Big Brother Titans is all about me. So how I feel about a specific housemate that will be evicted, all those things are things that you're going to be finding on my channel. So food, make sure that please, 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 I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. Do not, and I mean do not fight for food. Please, again, another thing, you don't live by yourself. Hygiene is key. We don't want, you don't want to be in a position where people are in the corner somewhere having a conversation and then when you come out and you go to the exact corner, people keep quiet simply because they've been talking about you. Maybe your armpits or down there, something is not right. You feel like because you're not doing anything, you're lying around waiting for Big Brother to give you a toss that you 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 are okay check you on yourself on a, on a, on, a, on a regular basis check your armpits bath at least twice like in the morning and also at night maybe when you are almost gonna have supper after a task but make sure that you bath twice you brush your teeth regularly don't wait for people to to gossip about you so that when you go out you'll be embarrassed and then it's not gonna be nice and if you know that maybe you've got a big body like myself and you are chosen to be in the house just like how I did it I really did not give a flying fish as to like I know that there are people that are watching me while I'm bathing but I knew that I would rather be watched and, and, and people see me naked there's nothing new there than for people to sit in a corner somewhere and speak about me having a body odor or, or not smelling good or my 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 thingy my my mouth smells a certain way it wouldn't be nice because the internet stores everything and it will forever be there and you cannot recover from that you will never ever recover from people telling you that you've got a body odor or an oral odor as anything along those lines so do make sure that you are clean to the core do make sure that you also participate in things that happen in the house and if you cannot cook yes we're not saying go and cook and forcefully do so but don't lie and tell people that you cannot cook and lie around and don't do anything you don't have a mate there please you did not go there with emily your aim is to play all the games and the tasks and to be develop personally while you are aiming for the prize money that is set out for you guys so make sure that you participate if you can't cook wash the dishes do something don't wait for for the head of house to feel like a boss and call you guys and tell you all the things that needs that you already know and some things that you should have practiced when you were in your house already flush the toilet make sure that the toilet when you go inside the toilet the toilet you find it the same way that it was but in a sense that if you find that it wasn't clean, obviously you're going to call up on somebody. But then we are old, we are all adults. Why would you want to leave the toilet in a state that you wouldn't want to go inside and see and also use? So make sure that you are that person that is neat and tidy and it will go out and, and it will be something that is loved and it will be captured by your fans and your fans will truly love the person that you are because they will see that you are coming from a very decent household where rules were set and you followed the those rules you know your chores you know everything if you can't do something think of another thing that will still be beneficial for the whole crew so that you will not just be sitting there lying around and doing nothing and even though you can see that whatever conversation that is taking place is too much content and you you can feel that the cameras are are actually taking place in that please make sure that you rest so that you will obey big brother and focus on the next day and also set some days maybe in a week where you know that it's gonna be wire wire six to six where you guys are having fun and conversations and whatever i just want you guys to have fun and i just want you guys to uh do corrections in the mistakes that maybe all former housemates throughout all the seasons of big brother where wherever in the world you have watched and you do better so that all the brands that that are watching and all the brands that are looking for somebody to work with will actually choose you to be an ambassador and being an ambassador is very nice because there's good money that comes out of being an ambassador and I'm not talking about being an influencer and convincing people to use a product that you 
barely use or you haven't used yourself you just received it and then you have to convince people but i'm talking about you being an ambassador and the face of a specific product and when they are tasked try to your core and even though there is an instructor that is instructing you to do something whether it's gym try don't sit down and laze around and feel like you know what i'm the cool girl i'm not gonna do this gym is not my thing just participate and have fun so that you will grow and grow and grow and have as many followers as possible so that when you get outside life is gonna be good knowing that even if you didn't win there are specific things that you're gonna get that are out there and good like see the winner already of the season that we were on is is, is living a very good life and she's very blessed and you can't take that away from her Timber, Timber is one of the housemates Libo, like there is a list of people that are really doing good simply because they were setting certain examples and in the house and then people captured that look at Tato, the most talented household house house housemate rather i ever met what is it that tato cannot do tato can literally do everything tato can be a presenter tato can be a host in a club tato can be a dancer tato is an accountant tato is smart tato is very athletic tato is very fit tato can cook tato can wash dishes what is it that tato cannot do there is nothing that is why she's getting so much opportunities because she did not sleep on herself and that is why she's prospering like this because it shows that she was very hungry for this opportunity look at sister mara i'm not gonna name all of them but i'm just thinking of all the names of people that i i watched and i admired i saw that these people are actually hungry for this opportunity sister mara was the was was one of the house members of the housemates of people that were winning so many challenges in the house that is the power of succeeding and knowing that even if you didn't win you know that you tried so just come with that zeal and that energy and do not force to be a hyper person because we're gonna see right through you i just want south africa i know that this is gonna be very difficult for me to 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 actually uh say but i when you you know even with big brother africa there's never been a south africa that won is there I think they hasn't so I really would love for South Africa to win and overpower Nigeria but it is completely up to you guys because I love both the countries it really wouldn't matter where it's coming from who the winner is coming from rather um, or where yeah the, the, the winner is coming from I would just appreciate that there is a winner but for South Africa let's put our country on the map let's let us be the first if ever there will be a continuation of Titan let us be the ones that uh, put and put it there like set the record higher and, and 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 you know let it be known that South Africa is the first country in Big Brother Titans that actually succeeded and the winner emerged right from here in South Africa that would be the best thing that South Africa can actually achieve because we already know that Nigerians don't play when it comes to voting I know that our South Africans they are very good at talking on Twitter on Instagram when it comes to voting Dololo, zilch, nada, nothing. And then while Nigerians are actually talking and they are fighting them within themselves there on Twitter, but they are actually doing the job and they are campaigning so that uh, their favorite house member uh, or housemate will actually win. Respect, love yourself, and manifest it now, today. It's never too late. Even though you haven't received any feedback again, do not worry, do not cry. It's not the end of the day. You're not going to die. There's going to be other seasons of other different themes that are aligning with you. And I repeat that. And do not overthink it because you're not going to be able to sleep and you're going to stress and you're going to end up lacking on things that you are supposed to be doing again in your life uh, to continue with that so please guys i wish you all the best of luck and please tell me uh down below on the comment section as to like what freaks you the most with this situation that is taking place what is scaring you and what is making you feel uncomfortable because i am going to be bringing that content i can't wait because um i didn't live much in the house so this will be like me being big brother so i'll be watching 24 7 narrating and checking every little thing that is done there and asking for your opinions as well so it's gonna be um 
a controversial type of videos that I'm gonna be said in a very positive way that is going to make other people grow and people learn it's not about criticizing anybody but it's also about me having fun I've been stuck up in my own world where I forgot the things that I used to love and have passion of and you want to be the next person that has certain things whereby I've got a camera I've got my lights I've got whatever I can literally do what I love and what I love is presenting and I hope that as time goes by as I evolve and I grow into this I'm gonna be so perfect that a specific channel or a specific show will want me to be their host for their show because I know that that is what I do best my talent lies into speaking with people and me assuring them that they are good enough they are unique they are special they are loved and that they should love themselves they you need to be selfish and selfless at the same time so it's a bittersweet thing to be a human being because you cannot choose to be one you have to have your negativities and also your positivities so this is me just giving you that glimpse wanting you to just feel positive about this and even if you're not chosen watch it have fun wait for the next year and then you audition again but if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel please don't forget to subscribe please share the video and also comment do everything that youtube wants people to do so that it will go uh, viral or even if it doesn't go as big as because my channel is very small but let people be known let it be recommended to other people so that my channel will grow it will literally mean a lot to me because I, I I told myself that if employment of me getting gigs of maybe presenting and hosting that I want is not coming why wouldn't I just do it in the comfort of my own zone where the camera is here and there's no other people that are directing me I am directing myself I am the director I'm the producer I am the host and I can ha change the narrative whenever and however I want based on what my audience want so I'm taking this opportunity to do what I love at my at the, at the comfort of my own zone so I do believe that you guys can also see that I'm literally very hungry for this growth and success at the current moment so please like my video as much as possible comment and share it and also just partake in everything don't forget to click on the notification bell because it's another thing that will make you be aware that I've already uploaded a brand new video so from me guys your girl D-I-N-K-Y Dinky the Dinkinator the mover the shaker the vibe creator terminator master of distraction this is peace and I'm saying Zavuh